Feed the neighborhood with a tailgate ready big bow box. It's bow time. The Dukes defeated Bucknell 38 to three in the season opener. Despite winning by a margin of five touchdowns, more questions were raised than answers given about the team, especially after the first half. This team needs humbled a little bit, coming off the last game last year and all the hoopla in the off season, and they got a little bit of humble pie in the first half. With the passing game struggling, JMU decided to turn to redshirt senior transfer Jordan McLeod at QB. While the running game was clicking, Signetti assessed the offensive output. You got to be able to play. Better balanced football on offense. You can't just run the ball. You gotta be able to throw the ball too. Redshirt sophomore running back Kalon Black rushed for over 100 yards in the first half. He spoke about the running back's mindset to help the offense when the passing game isn't being executed. We're just going to take it play by play and do what we can to, to lift the team up. Um, we have to make sure we stay humble and not get too greedy out there. While the Dukes defense only gave up a field goal the entirety of the game, the team wasn't happy with their first half performance and wanted to improve in the second half. Understanding that that wasn't our standard. Definitely getting into the locker room, understanding where we made our mistakes at, and then just playing harder with more effort. Wide receiver Reggie Brown summed up the game and looks forward to the team's next matchup. We just got a lot of things to work on. I ain't going to say we thought we were better than what we are, but we know we got a lot of work to do. We're going to be way better next week. The Dukes will travel down 81 to face in-state rival UVA on on Saturday with kickoff slated for noon. Reporting from Bridgeforce Stadium, this is Colby Reese.